doing this. It has taken Meru 45 years to get a woman elected. The last time you got a woman elected is 45 years ago when Anirita Karim was elected as a, yes. uh, Anirita Karim was elected as MP Saudi Menti. Mm. What happened to Anirita Karim those years ago? Men came together and said when she was a principal in St. Mary's, she, she embezzled the, the funds for the school. And Karimi was, was put in jail for three years without even given a chance to defend herself. Yes. What is happening today? We are seeing Kawera Mwangaza. Men have ganged up and their girlfriends and their family members, they have ganged up to put her in jail or to put her out of a governorship position. What is her problem? What is Kawera's weakness? What, why is Kawera being persecuted? Kawera is being persecuted because of dreaming big. Yes. Kawera Mwangaza is being yes. persecuted because she decided to compete with people who knows that no one can defeat them like Kareito Moronge. Yes. Kawera is being persecuted because she defeated men and this range of men think our position is in the kitchen and the bedroom. Yes. And we want to tell them this is 21st century, and girl child is going to rest. Africa is tilting towards women leadership. Yes. Kenya is tilting towards women leadership. Look at Nakuru County. Look at Machakos County. Look at our sister, Sister Mbarire in Embu. Why is it that here in Meru, that we, are, we cannot rest politically, and men just want to knife us every time a woman rises? Our president, we want to ask you, and the Senate of this republic. I saw Kiraito Moronge in one of the media houses here saying that, uh, uh, he was asked if there is threshold for impeachment and he said it is not a question judicial process and he said that it is more for political. We want to tell senators of this country, Kaduri Morenge is your colleague, but please don't massage his ego. Yes. We are asking you yes. please don't massage Kaduri Morenge's ego. Please protect our governor when she's brought to that senate house by not massage. Even MCS they took off. Can you imagine, even 45 years ago, Anirita Karemi won because there was a oath which was taken and the courts nullified the elections. Today again we saw MCS taking oath in, in Jorisheke shrines mm, yes. to go and impeach the governor. Mm. Why is it that today in Meru County all this, all this being used to impeach a governor, an elected governor? Please President, please Senators of this country, protect our woman governor. We love her so much. She's working for us and we are saying yeah. the Kumi Bira Bread.